cameras inside this Escambia school bus show us how unpredictable the road can be. This bus, T-boned by a dump truck back in August, students not wearing their seat belts flung from their seats. If you're cringing at home seeing this, you're not alone. It's the reason Zolma Hestris tells her kids the importance of buckling up in the bus. While she's at work, they're on the bus on their way home from school. They do use their seat belts every single time that we ride in the cars. She's confident that habit carries over to the bus, but the truth is it's hard for drivers to really be sure every kid is buckled up. If some of the student stays in the seat, you, won't, you would never be able to tell that they're out of the seat belt. That's why the school district had these signs made, a clear message to buckle up in the school bus. The idea is for your kids to see this sign before they get on the bus. That's why it'll be going on yards or fences in schools all around Escambia County. Symbols that uh, show seat belts. And then Rob Doss with the school district tells us the signs will start going up this week, beginning at elementary schools. It's uh, pretty effective because it puts the information right in the student's face. But the district reaching out to parents too. Parents like Zulma should expect a call from the school soon, reminding her to have a talk with her kids about the importance of belts. She's firm with that message, sure that her kids buckle up everywhere. My kids are really good about that and I, I'm pretty sure they do. I, I really trust them. But it wouldn't hurt to remind them. The signs should be up in all Escambia schools by the end of the month. Reporting in Escambia County, Anthony Perra, Channel 3 News.